Hi there. I am going to make a longbow. Um, and it's going to be one of the giveaway prizes coming up at 20,000 subscribers. I will not give you the details on how to enter um, the giveaway uh, in this video. This is just a presentation of the, of the longbow and I will be um, I will um, come back to the giveaway in an upcoming video. So uh, obviously you will have to be a subscriber to uh, have a chance to win this longbow. So uh, if you're not already a subscriber to this channel then uh, please hit that subscribe button. So as you can see this has already been started this bow here. Actually um, it was um, roughed out, as they say, by a, uh, a um, well, a student really, because um, I had some people here who, want, who wanted to uh, learn how to build uh, a longbow and um, a flat boat and so on. Um, that's uh, a very long time ago now. Well, at least a year, maybe a couple of years. Um, I think. So it has been lying around here. <coughs> um, so I'm going to, uh, it's an elm, it will be an, this is elm, a Norwegian elm and I am going to see if I can make this into a uh, workable longbow. I'm going to just start working. It's, it's not this is not going to be a, um, hold on, I'll, I'll bring the camera closer. <clears throat> so this is not going to be a uh, how to build a bow video because I already have made a couple of those. So I will just uh, quite quickly shape this bow now and uh, I will not be finishing it because um, the winner of the giveaway, uh, so it depends on the winner. I will do the last last shaping of the bow after I know who, who wins this bow. Um, because of course it depends on, uh, on, uh, on that person, how long does that person draw the bowstring and so on. So I'm not going to finish this bow right now. I'm going to wait, uh, as I said, until after uh, I know who the winner is. Okay, the first thing I will do is to straighten out the whole bow here. Yeah, it's not going to be a very heavy bow. Um, it's already quite thin. I think it will be uh, around 40, 35, 40 pounds. <clears throat> I should have tidied up this uh, workbench here. Yeah. So I have the bow now up on the tiller. This, this is a tiller. And um, I have straightened the bow stave so that it looks much better now. Now it's not totally straight. Um, it has, but it, it doesn't have to be. Um, it doesn't have, has to be straight. Um, it just needs to be lined up at three points uh, here and at the handle and at the other tip. 
So now I'm going to start tilling the bow, <clears throat> which means I will be um, I will be adjusting the bow. Um, I want it to bend evenly, which is quite important. Um, so I'm putting the bow up here. And this is a tillering string, it's not a bow string. Yeah, I'll have to <coughs> make a deeper notch here. Okay, so we have the bow up here on the on the tiller. Uh, I had to move the camera because I think that the window behind the tiller uh, made uh, it a bit difficult for the camera to focus. I'm sorry about that. What I'm doing now is I'm just pulling down at the tillering string. Um, I then take a step back. And I'm trying to see if the bow bends evenly, which it does actually. It's not too bad. I'm noticing that towards the tip there, it's stiffer than on the other side, which I'm going to correct right now. Again. A little bit further this time. Okay. Let's try to bring the camera around. You can see for yourself if it bends evenly. Okay. Put the camera over here again. Now the tilting is, um, in my opinion, the most fun part of the of the bow building process. Now I'm noticing that in this part it's it needs to be thinned out a little bit. And we have a hinge here so we'll need to be careful in this area. Forty and a half centimeters here, and we have the exact same here. Actually, <clears throat> I think it's. Um, I'm going to have to put the real bowstring on soon. Now, I have to say, I have already told you, 
this is going to be one of the 20,000 subscribers giveaway prizes. Um, I kind of regret saying that because I would have wanted this bow for myself, actually. <laughs> it's going to be a wonderful bow. I really like it already. It's just, it's going to be beautiful. So we have the bowstring on and it is, I can tell you, it's an extremely lightweight bow. Um, it's just, it weighs next to nothing. Um, and when I pull the bow, the bow does not want to twist, which means that uh, the bowstring is in the middle of the handle. 35. That's uh, 33 and a half. This is a little bit stiffer. I need to find out where the bow limb does not. I'm, yeah, it's. I think it's here. This area. So, this is called a cabinet scraper. And since I am uh, almost finished with the till ring now, I'm using this scraper to take off the tool marks and, and, and so on. And the cabinet scraper, it has the advantage of that you, you, you take off some material here uh, without leaving tool marks. So it's, it's a great little tool. Okay, so as you can see, it's bent much more now. I've actually tilted this down to 24 inches, uh, which um, is where I will leave it for now. Um, most people have a longer draw than 24 inches. Uh, I just figure that uh, uh, since I don't know uh, the draw length of the winner yet, I will uh, just leave it here. No point in, in um, tailoring the bow more until I know. So I will just sand the bow now and uh, put some linseed oil on it. Obviously, I will have to do that again um, when I do the last uh, tillering and the last adjustments. Um, but it looks good. It looks good. I had no problems at all with this bow. Um, wonderful. I really like this bow. Just thought I would measure. Um, I would measure the the weight at twenty four inches. Yeah. So it is almost 30 pounds at uh, 24 inches. If you drew this bow longer now, a couple of inches longer, it would, be, it would probably be at around 35, somewhere around there.
I've wrapped some paper around the bow because it's I just put oil on it. I have um, my target there. So I'm just I know it's um, a bit too early to start shooting the bow really but just need to try a few arrows and I'm not going to um, and I'm not going to pull of course all the way up to my my face because that would uh, the, the bow needs to be uh, you need to shoot in the bow as they say at least a hundred partial draws before you gradually uh, start using your normal draw. So that's all for now and uh, obviously if you want to have a chance to win this longbow you will have to be a subscriber to this channel. All the other details and the other giveaway prices and so on I will talk about that in an upcoming video. I hope you enjoyed this video and um, I hope you will be back watching uh, next week as well and um, thank you for spending this time with me and uh, have a nice day and take care. <laughs>